jump into this one courtesy of over under um featuring the unreleased pair of off-white and nike air force one lows in a light green spark that look absolutely incredible i really want these so 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 bad these color block air force ones that virgil did um the ones in green the ones in yellow the ones in blue i think are some of his strongest work especially on the air force one um especially with the way that he did the switch especially with the way that he did the, the inside lining and what and all these little details and just um the pigment of them as well looks really good i don't know if it's like i'm assuming it's something that's been worked on many 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 hours um that he kind of slaved over in terms of finding the right hue um the right pantone uh the right contrast whatever it may be to get them to hit this way but they look so good i'm such a fan of them and i really really am now whether or not i'll be able to cop and be able to purchase and have these on my feet also it remains to be seen right but in terms of an Air Force One, this is definitely one of my favorite iterations because what I do like about Virgil when he did make these Air Force Ones similar to the complex ones that he did and the other black ones, um, I forgot the name of those ones, they just, they they follow a simple formula in that he loves the color block or one color. He loves to have the laces be contrasting and then have the silver swoosh which reminds me, funnily enough, of one of my favorite Air Max 90s that I used to have back in the day that I actually collected. I think I bought them like three times over and ended up reselling them again. But they're one of my favorite pairs of, Air, of Nike of Air Max 90s, right? Which is one of my favorite sneakers of all time too. Actually, I say if I, if, if I was to have a top five in no, in no order, in top five sneakers of all time, have to be an Air Max, an Air Max 90, Air Force One, Air Jordan 4, Maybe it's a top three, yeah. MX90, Air Force One, Air Jordan 4. I can't think of it. What was everyone's? Okay, what was it Jordan 1 as my top of all time? Now, I can't say that because I didn't wear them enough. Even I've got loads now. But anyway, we'll get to the story. So I had a pair of uh, MX90s in black um, that I think I'm pretty sure originally I copped them from Foot Locker. But then obviously over time, I ended up buying them on resale from other people on eBay. But essentially what they were, what they were like an all black Air Force One with a weird tumbled leather-esque feel to them. And then they had a silver metallic silver swoosh on the side. And if I'm not mistaken, the air bubble was like a slight yellow tint of a color. It wasn't clear. It was like a yellow tint -y sort of a color. They looked so good. And that was one of my, that might have been the reason why I'm so, so obsessed with all black trainers with a little hit with like a white swoosh or with like a white outsole, a white midsole. But I do like that Virgil kind of had the same idea and sort of like flipped it in his own way by having the different sort of colors. But I think that's why I've always been a fan of these Air Force Ones and similar to the complex ones too that I saw that I thought were, cr were absolute crazy because they shouldn't work like this, right? With the contrasting black laces, they really shouldn't work, but they do. They really hit for some reason. Um, I love them. I know they're, they're, they're pretty much goon shoes, right? For sure, all the trappers and all the rappers will absolutely be hoovering these things up. But I can't wait to wear, wear a pair of these and take some silver markers to the midsole and write something on them you know in kind of as a as a kind of homage to Virgil as well and that'll be pretty sick to do because i think they'll they'll really show up pretty well on these but i love them and i think they look bloody awesome like all green ugh, so 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 amazing i'm such a big fan hopefully they're you're able to cop um i doubt it there's no kind of indication of when they're meant to come out are they no we don't really have an indication when they're due to come out but when they do come out Agassino will try his best to cop but whether or not he tries and he's successful is two different things